I'm Rob Ionello. I'm the head football coach here at the University of Akron. Go Zips. Let's go. Let's go to work and have a good work day. Got to have a good work day. He spent 23 years coaching at some of the best football schools in the country. Alabama, Wisconsin, Arizona, Notre Dame. Come on, here we go. Now let's go back and try that again. Get back, get back on the ground. Get back on the ground. If that's the enthusiasm, if that's the enthusiasm we're coming to work with today, that's not near good enough. Now Rob Ionello has his shot to run the show. He's just the sixth head football coach at the University of Akron in the last 50 years. This game's too hard if you don't have enthusiasm, man. The game's way too hard if you don't play with enthusiasm. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. When you come to work every day, you want to be at a place where what you do is very important. And it's obvious that football is very important here at the University of Akron. Coming through here, and you're just escaping out. Bam, right here. Okay, he's there, you're here, we're going. They've made a huge commitment to football. And now our task is to give them a football program equal to that commitment. And the only program that's going to be equal to that is going to be a championship program. Good job right there. Good job right there. If you're a member of our program, um, there's three things that we hope to touch you with every single day you're here. And the first one of those is your academic development. And I want our guys having high expectations for themselves academically. I want them pushing themselves academically. I'm not naive enough to think I'm going to have a team of 4.0s, but I am going to have a team of guys that are working at it in school. I am going to have a group of guys that are sitting in front of the classroom. I am going to have a bunch of guys that are, that are working to their capabilities academically. Here, here, out here, wide, away from him, not right into him, out here, wide, wide and hitch. That's why it's called a wide and hitch. Okay? So if you're part of our program, your, your academic development, you reaching your academic potential, is going to be the first thing on our list that we do every day. The second thing, um, which is obviously very important to the young people that are looking around, is their athletic development. Now what could happen is he still might run the sight adjust route on the weak corner, but if you, if you know the, that the weak set, that the tailback's got him, just work over here. Okay? That's important to you. You want to be developed That's as an athlete when you go to a school. And there's a couple components to go into doing that. And the first component is our strength coach. I wanted to hire a guy that when the guys went in the weight room, it wasn't monotonous. It was, I know I'm going to get better today. How can I get started? And that's what we have in our weight room. The second thing is our assistant coaches. And top to bottom, you know, I think we have the best staff in our league. We have guys that have coached a lot of great places. We have guys that have coached in the Sugar Bowl, and coached in the Rose Bowl, and called defenses in some really big environments, and called offenses in some really big environments. And you know, that's the experienced staff. I'm humbled by that staff, excited about that staff. And, and, and know that they're going to develop the young people they're working with. Alex, usually second guy out, is wide open. Then our schemes. Um, the last thing a part of your athletic development is, is what we do on offense and defense. All right? if, you know, if you're an offensive lineman, you're going to get taught to pass block and to run block. You know, both of those. You're not going to be in an offense that just plays the one or the other. You know, if you're a quarterback, you're going to get to play in a system that Tom Brady plays in, that Matt Castle plays in. Same system. Um, that they use in the NFL, they use on Sundays. You got a hook, right? But if he stays deep, you could do this, Pat. You with me? He says they're going a little pop pass. All right, we'll throw it to you right here. Now, not if he comes down, come here. Safety comes down on you, we're not going to do that. You're going to be smart and you're going to turn out. So your athletic development is very important to us. It should be important to them, to you as a young man. And the last part of your development here in our football program is your personal come development. Out because your parents are going to send a young man to college and it's reasonable for them to expect they're going to get a man in return four or five years later. We want to make sure that we do that. And how do you do that? Well, first being part of our team. 30,000 people on the game day, half's going to be saying John, the other half's going to be saying Root. You got to tell him what's going on. We teach them about accountability. We teach them about discipline. We teach them about um, being a te good team member. W what are the sacrifices involved in being a good team member? Get back in the huddle. You got to get out of the huddle, and hey, you can't, you got to look to make sure he's lined up. And the last part of your personal development, all right, is going to be the things we do in the community. I'm, I'm a firm believer in community service. I'm a firm believer in our team giving back to the Akron community. That is an important part of our program. That's going to help our guys appreciate what they have here, but also learn about giving back. Um, so your personal development, your athletic development, your academic development, those are core, core parts of our program here 
And I believe we can do all three of those and build the championship program around it. Coach Ionello's uh, brought a wonderful uh, brand of football to our program and is uh, putting the building box in place for a championship program. Uh, a lot goes into that. He and his staff have worked uh, very hard to establish a level of discipline and commitment to success uh, that we think will have a very bright future for us here at the University. Go again, go again! <laughs> Akron football has a chance to take off and become the marquee program in the Mid-American Conference. And I believe that every day we come to work. And that's what we're working towards. There's a difference between a championship team and a championship program. A championship team has one really good season. A championship program has that season doesn't look back. We're working to build ourselves a championship program that can be in the contention for our league every single year. One, two, three, two. Let's go now. Hop around. Hop around. Hop around. Get some great work done here. Hop around. Hop around. Here we go.